Welcome to Enchanted Tarot, and this is for the sign of Capricorn for the month of August. It is a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every one of you who are watching. If this does not sound like your story, check your moon and your rising sign. Your messages could be there. If not, check back in the following week uh, when I put out a new message for your sign. Okay, so <clears throat> this is really a tale of gossip and how uh, this can destroy somebody's relationship. I feel you may have, for whoever this is for, you may have uh, placed your trust in the wrong person, um, believing that person because you trusted them, um, when in fact, uh, I, I feel like it's like a deliberate um, attempt to destroy your relationship with your partner. So, um, <clears throat> let's begin up here. No, actually, I'm going to begin here um, with Halfus, a uh, card of respite. You see, I, upheaval would have been the next one underneath it. And the Halfus is um, it's about like the calm before the storm. Um, he, uh, he's farsighted, so he senses danger long before there's any clear evidence of it, um, and urges preparation for war. And we see, uh, somebody being on the defensive over here, um, okay. At the bottom of the deck, we have this, uh, this eagle, and you can see how, you see how the wings are drawn back like that? That's a defensive position, okay? With that, we have the lion and the shield. So, um, the lion is about taking action or wanting to act, um, needing to defend or feeling defensive, feeling um, like you have to defend something. Um, it could be the eagle and the lion could be two separate people. And the eagle on the attack and, <laughs> and the lion needing to defend themselves. Okay, let's continue. Try to get more pieces of the puzzle. Here we have the jester. With regards to this situation with the jester, um, there will be some uh, luck in some way or form, even if it doesn't feel like it, okay, in a moment. Now, the jester... Um, is wearing a smile. Uh, well, actually, he's wearing uh, the quote on the card is like uh, his face wears a frown. He so he cannot pretend to be a, a clown. So it's like um, the worry behind the the the, the face all the worries that this jester has. It's, it's an event uh, that someone fears or dreads. Now, it has to do uh, with uh, some advice or wisdom or new wisdom that flew towards this person with the bird and the coffer. So the coffer indicates something was gained. So some type of wisdom with the owl and the bird are gained, some uh, message. Now, the fish speaks to gossip. And the apple is the temptation to believe that gossip. Why? Because um, you trusted in this person, okay? with the cat. So 
the cat and I don't feel it's your partner. I feel this is somebody external that's causing trouble. The cat is somebody you have placed your trust in. It could be somebody wearing uh, two faces, um, a friend, someone close to you. With sweet little words and a pleasant face, the traitor convinces and gains your good graces. It is an ill omened card. And whatever information, gossip you receive that you are tempted to believe is what's causing this, it looks to me like uh, a confrontation that is taking place. Now understand these energies can be uh, reversed. And whatever this is causes a bridge to break. And I would also like to add that whatever this is, it is not true. It is somebody causing trouble. So if you, you may have received a message, a gossip about your partner being unfaithful or that your partner was going to leave you for someone else, it is untrue. It's been, it's a plot here with that page being in a reverse. This is the gossip that you're tempted to believe. It has to do with a betrayal, Ten of Swords. It has to do with the tower, an ending. And the Judgment card, and it's, it's falling on a wish, you see. And if you look closely at this Judgment card, what other cards do we see here? We see the Ace of Hearts. So we know that this is a relationship, right? We see the Three of Swords here. We see the Ace of Swords here and the Two of Hearts. So this is a very emotional decision on a relationship that has brought you pain. But, you know, it is, um, it is brought on by an external force, which, you know, is typically uh, what the tower has to do with. It's something external that comes in uh, unexpectedly, some type of revelation, shocking news. And you were shocked by this news. Why well, see it here? Because this person was your Ten of Cups. But now, uh, I mean, this could be, this Eight of Cups could be this news about them uh, wanting to leave the relationship and you want to get to the truth of it. Because the Queen of Swords, she's got her sword up in the air and she looks ready for, uh, for, um, <laughs> for action, wanting to get to the truth of this matter. And she's not just going to sit back and wait. She's uh, um, she uh, is going to take action. She's not sitting back to wait on the results or wait for the event to happen. She's going after the results. Now, she has her sword up. And her partner is here and he has his sword up. Somebody here is not playing fair. And I don't feel that it's either of these people. I feel that it is a third person causing mischief, causing trouble. And whatever you've heard or are tempted to believe... is causing uh, this, this break. 
or is causing you or has caused you to lose faith in it and the bridge is broken now he's insisting he's not done anything you want to get to the truth because you believe this other person you've trusted in so it's almost like nothing's happening the bridge is a meeting place um a midpoint and you know he's he's insisting here that he's done nothing wrong <laughs> so, you know and he hasn't I know with the uh, the gossip that came flying at you quite unexpectedly with regards to the two of cups seems to be in the moment insurmountable and you're unable to decide what to do with it because you know this person was your ten of cups and now all of that it seems to be in chaos look at the cards just flying So now you must uh, withdraw to think about this, um, to think about this decision, to decide upon a direction with regards to a deception. You're looking at the details, but it's like um, I feel like you it feels like you're looking at the details and and you're still unclear i feel like you don't know quite what to believe i mean he's insisting he's not done anything your experiences perhaps with this person probably suggest that he would not have done anything either but you have this other person whom you have trust in who could be a close friend or someone you thought was a friend that says differently and you're tempted to believe them why the same king appears here and he's trying to figure things out okay um there will there will be news from him and maybe he does figure out who uh, who's done what or what caused this because this the king and the knight comes with the knight and the knight sends out his minions so he's done the work to figure out what happened here and there will be news of this and this will clear things up because the Sun is here it will shed light on this whole thing what you feared was out of balance what you feared was out of balance if you feared there was a third person this all gets um, this all gets cleared up and there is a healing here there's news coming you have a uh, vol which is a card of harmony and aureus which is a card of inspiration so um with vol it's um a time for settling old debts and the rekindling of this relationship aureus strive for harmony and listen to your instinct he will show you the way he carries the um the staff with two ster two serpents that are twined around it the caduceus okay so he will bring enlightenment
you know, it's time here to trust in your intuition and your feeling. Now, I think that you may not have listened to it in the beginning because you trusted the other person who was delivering the gossip. So, you know, in the future, this has a happy ending, but in the future, um, be careful of who you place your trust in. So this person will get found out because he is going to find out who it was. I see that he sends out his minions, so he's, he's going to find out who this is. What caused this disturbance here? And he will bring that clarity to you. So you will get your happy ending. Just, you know, in the future, be careful who you trust. <laughs> Don't listen to gossip. I thank you for watching, for liking and um, sharing my videos and for subscribing. Also, uh, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.